My name is James Bonin, and I'm directing Tom Stoppard's Arcadia at APT this summer. Nineteen years ago, standing right over there, when Brenda DeVita was the company manager, I had just directed her husband and Richard III, and we were standing at the top of the theater, and I said to her, you guys ought to do Arcadia here. And so, you know, it, here we are. I mean, I just think it really is uh, among the very, very best contemporary writing. And I think the seventh scene where he combines the two periods of time uh, is really the most heartbreaking and beautiful writing that I know in the last 50 years in the theater. And the play's about wanting to know things and the importance of knowing things. And I've spent my whole life wanting to know things and learning as much as I can, and I just feel like it's a great thing to send people home with, is to, is to realize that uh, a hunger to understand is a beautiful, beautiful way to live your life, and that's what we should strive for. You could probably talk about the table for hours in this play, but I, I th Stoppard, I think, uses it as a, as a kind of symbol of deterministic chaos because the table accumulates over the course of seven scenes so many pieces of memorabilia from the play and frequently there'll be someone standing looking at one prop and the same thing will be right next to them but they can't see it because they're in a different time frame. The table for Arcadia the number one thing that struck me was how big it was and they're going oh my gosh I've not done anything that big. The second issue on it was the shape of the legs. There's two profiles to the legs. And I just went, how is, it, really? How do you do this? I said, oh, well, this corner is not a 45, 45 corner. So I experimented and was fortunate to hit it on the first try. It's a 55, 35 corner. And when I did that and compared it to the designer's draftings, it was almost a perfect match. It really does feel like an anchor. It's the only thing in the room, that's the way it's written. And people use it just to work. In the last scene of the play, there's this fabulous sequence where two people from 1812 and two people from 1990 are all sitting at the table at their spaces working. It's heavenly.